Hey everybody, it's Uncle Doug. We're out uh, today at a mobile home park near the cave, taking apart a big giant mobile home. There's Mike and Carrie and Perry and Mark and Cindy, and there went Cindy in right there. And uh, we got this big old dumpster, and uh, we're, uh, we got a deal to take this all apart, and we can have the frame that we can use for our stage and the amphitheater. And a lot of this wood we're going to be able to use for the greenhouse or for other stuff. So uh, the windows, the toilets, other stuff. So we're taking this whole thing apart. Nice sunny day. We're fixing to take a break, go to McDonald's, get in the air conditioning for a minute. And then we'll uh, get back to it for a while. And then Sunday, Sunday meeting tonight. So there's Cindy. Hello. <laughs> So anyway, more later, we'll give you an update as we go along here. Hey guys, it's Uncle Doug. We're out here at the mobile home park again. I uh, wanted to update you on the progress we're making. This is our second day out here. Uh, got a crew out. We've got, uh, there's the whole big thing here. There's Cindy down there working. We've got, uh, oh, most of the inside gutted. The front third without walls, we're gonna try and salvage the two by fours. We actually cut, I don't know if you can see it here. There's a, a dust row right up the roof right there where we cut with a sawzall. We're gonna try and salvage that piece of the roof and maybe every 12 feet, drop them down on the trailer, transport it like that, and then use these for, I don't know, carports or workshops or you know 10 by 12 kind of uh, sheds or something so uh, the trusses are in good shape the roofs in good shape it's fairly new looks pretty nice so trying to recycle everything we can we got uh, plastic skirting pipes metal recycling some some uh, panels that came off mostly in one piece we can recycle two by fours a lot of those one by threes one by fours we're going to try and recycle use for the new greenhouse or something and then the goal this thing's way too big and uh, it's 75 feet but all the wheels are right here in the back by Cindy there's one two three four axles way back here and uh, what we're going to try to do is get it to the farm and then cut the trailer about in half and use this back piece as a stage in the back where we could put on a concert or something someday down the road. Um, I'd like to keep the roof and three walls and just take this wall out that's already rotted, but I don't think it'll move like that. I don't think it's stable enough. If we just leave like half this roof back, uh, I don't know. I don't know if it'll behave so uh, we may have to have some support in the middle or of the roof but uh, anyway we're we're gonna get this dropped when we get the tractor has got a flat tire the big wheel in the tractor so it's at the shop and then he cut here too uh, and uh, then the battery ran out on the cordless uh, sawzall circular saw so but we got to cut these these rafters right there headers and then that that roof should be able to just set it down gently with the tractor when we remove all the sidewalls i don't know we'll see maybe it'll crash and burn and we'll have to scrap it but we're rapidly filling up the dumpster so we'll do what we can do this was all the junk that was in there furniture and stuff so we're trying to figure out how to end up not having to burn more of it or take it to some other in uh whatchamacallit um landfill um where they'll burn it off or something i don't know what they do with it but um uh the owner guy he's just paying for the one dumpster so we got to try to fit it all in there or take it with us or something but uh a lot of rafters underneath may need replacing and this header this header board that right here is rotted that's why he didn't want to take it down the road this whole wall just way it wobbles Anyway, it's a beautiful day. We'll update you more on some other stuff that's going on. Um, I'm going to try and take a minute, set up the camera and do a video here in a minute. It's a nice day and I need a break. 
So uh, anyway, more in a minute, hopefully. God bless you. Bye. Hey guys, it's Uncle Doug. Here we are again, uh, moving along on this demolition. This is, uh, we've had about two weeks to do this. We got one more day till they take the dumpster. And uh, here we go, we have dropped the roof. Cut it in about a 10 foot section. Another 10 foot section and about a 15 foot section there. Maybe a little more. And uh, dropped the roof down onto the trailer. And um, we just got this one little section left here. And uh, there, we can probably get it dropped tonight before the sun goes down. Um, and we're just getting the furnace, the water heater, a bathtub, toilet, uh, connections, all that stuff out of there. This one's a little complicated because we got an electrical box. Right here is the big electrical box. We got to work around with a stump in front of it too. But uh, we're getting there. And um, this is all stuff we want to keep. Either scrap metal, aluminum, piping, or 2x4s, which we think we can reuse somewhere. And um, oh, there goes the furnace. I got to go get that with the tractor here. I'm sitting on the Kubota. And um, maybe we drop this tonight. They come to they come Friday for the dumpster, and so we got one more day with that. And uh, we're getting pretty close. And then what we're gonna do is haul this to haul this to our property, and maybe use these roofs for little sheds, storage sheds, or uh, whatever. So this roof here, I'm not sure how strong it is. This one here, and this one have really good trusses. I don't know if you can see inside there. Probably not. But they have some pretty good trusses that held together really, really well. And could go up on a little pole barn or a little something in the garden. So we'll see. Um, anyway, uh, get along. More pretty soon. Bye.